The primary function of both the pressure regulator and pressure regulating unloader valve is to set and maintain consistent system pressure. They also act as a primary pressure relief device. System pressure is set by tightening or loosening the adjustment knob. Turning clockwise will increase pressure, while turning counterclockwise will reduce pressure. System pressure is maintained by regulating the amount of flow through the bypass port. As you can see, at maximum system pressure there is very little flow through the bypass. But when pressure is reduced, more flow is diverted through the bypass. The difference between the regulator and unloader occurs when flow downstream is suddenly stopped, most commonly in a trigger gun application. Using a regulator, system flow is redirected through the bypass port, maintaining full system pressure. An unloader, on the other hand, contains a check valve and passageway to the top of the piston stem. When flow downstream is suddenly stopped, a pressure spike occurs, closing the passageway with the check valve, trapping pressure in the discharge line. This forces water through the passageway pushing on top of the piston stem, which opens the restriction on the bypass. This allows flow at low pressure to cycle through the bypass, reducing product wear and energy consumption. This also reduces heat rise in a closed loop system. When flow is re-established, trap pressure is relieved opening the check valve, allowing the piston stem to return to the original position, re-establishing set system pressure. As you can see in this side-by-side -side comparison, when the nozzle is open, both the regulator and unloader maintain consistent system pressure. When the gun is closed, the regulator continues to hold system pressure, while the unloader traps the pressure on the discharge side while unloading the pump to minimal pressure on the inlet side.